Hey guys, sorry I got cut off. A uh, phone call came in during my rant. <laughs> so this will be part number two for this federal judge or this judge in San Francisco who uh, told Trump and the feds to piss off. He's not going to follow the law. You know, what I was about to say before I got cut off is the elite, the upper echelon, you know, those who are more important than us, the citizens, those who get to decide what laws to follow, what laws to break, and what laws to create, they are not held accountable. But if you and I do something like uh, not pay our taxes or, you know, not pay a speeding ticket, or whatever, you know, name any petty law you can think of. If we don't abide by it, we go to prison, we lose our homes, we lose our jobs, we can lose our families. We are destroyed as a human being if we don't follow the rules. These fuckers do whatever they want with impunity. When is this crap going to stop? I think, personally, it's going to take an entire system reset. A purge. You know, just like the movie, it needs to be purged. You need to cut the cancer out. Physically cut it out. Get rid of it. And start over. Look, make me your president. My first act as president, president backcountry, I abolish liberalism. If you want to be a liberal, you'll either move out or you go to prison. This is crazy. We're living in a backwards time. The founding fathers, if they were here, they would beat our asses for, uh, for us allowing this to happen. We would get the snot kicked out of us by the founding fathers. You know, those men put their lives on the line when they seceded from England. You know, that was a crime punishable by death, and they still did it. Because they had balls back then. Where the hell did our balls go? Shit, Hillary Clinton still has hers. You know what, that's going to be the topic of my next video. Men, where are our balls at? The backcountry prepper, tell me what you guys think. Prep and thrive.